Good morning everyone! So this is episode 3 of our favorite brunch places. This one is a bit different because we actually have never been here before and we just wanted to try it out. It is nestled in St. Clair West Village, um, otherwise known as the Stockyards and it's called Emma's Country Kitchen. So we're pretty excited. It's gotten really awesome reviews on basically everywhere and part of the reason we wanted to go here is because they opened up a new Target store in the Stockyard so we're probably gonna hit that up afterwards before we go inside though I wanted to do a quick outfit of the day um, so my bag is just this um, Louis Vuitton Neverfull MM this trench coat is from Zara I just ordered it online the other day and super fast shipping from Zara and I just really like it. It's a raincoat, so it's kind of like a nylon material, so it's very water resistant, perfect for the rainy days we've been having. Jeans are from The Gap, they're just distressed, and the top is from Target, and I'm wearing Sperry's. So that is the outfit, and we're just going to go inside and have some brunch. have a really cute table it's kind of very cozy um, yeah just in this little corner here we just finished ordering I would say the menu is reasonably priced um, entrees kind of range between let's say 10 13 dollars kind of similar to La Neuf, um, and a little bit more inexpensive than Mildred's uh, Temple Kitchen which is the first place that we went to and yeah so I ordered the classic and um, the Beau ordered this like hangover helper sounds really really good and we're just enjoying some coffee. Coffee is really good so that's key and um, yeah we're just gonna wait for our food to come. Okay we're finished at Emma's Country Kitchen and the food was amazing. Oh my gosh I could stay there and eat bacon all day long. So like I said, I got the classic, which is just like the typical breakfast that you can get at most places. And the bow got this like hangover helper, which was like a hamburger, but the hamburger was like a sausage patty and it was bacon. It was so good. Uh, so highly recommend this place. It doesn't look like much from the outside, but food is amazing. Service was really great and it's reasonably priced for brunch in Toronto. Um, it is a ways away from our regular downtown bubble, um, but I would say it's definitely worth it. Worth a little road trip up uptown. Um, so we're going to probably hit up Target now and we'll see you guys in our next brunch installment. Bye! Okay, just a quick note, we forgot to mention that Emma's Country Kitchen also sells donuts, which are apparently amazing. So we got one to share because we don't want to eat too many because the breakfast was very filling. Uh, what flavor did we get? Uh, maple bacon. We got maple bacon, so, um, oh my god, it looks so good. That is what it looks like, and um, follow up later when we tell you how good it tastes because it probably tastes amazing. Mm -hmm. 